head to Julian where it is pretty gusty. You can see the flag waving in the wind there at the Pioneer Museum. And that's from gusts up to 18 miles per hour. Stronger at Hellhole Canyon up in the North County. 42 mile per hour gusts there. 36 down in Campo, 37 in Pine Valley. Alpine right about 30. So if you're traveling along the 8 today, you are going to be dealing with those winds, especially if you're a tall vehicle. You're going to notice your, uh, your car moving around in the wind quite aggressively at times. Our 10 News feature cast really doing a good job highlighting the foothill and the mountain areas as the strongest wind spots today. This is at 930. Those winds are going to pick up after sunrise and they'll remain pretty gusty through 10 a.m. That's when that wind advisory is set to expire, but the winds will remain pretty breezy through about 11 o'clock at noon and then they'll start to taper off a lot more as we head into the afternoon. Due to those calming winds and the clear skies, it is going to be quite brisk as we ring in the new year. 50s for the coast, 40s for the inland neighborhoods and the deserts with 30s in the mountains at midnight. So that storm right there, the wraparound circulation is bringing in those mild Santa Ana winds today. So dry but fairly gusty end to 2019. Cool as we head into midnight tonight, but then we're talking about a warm up for early 2020. Now along the coast, we won't see a big change in temperatures. Mid to upper 60s today, low to mid 60s tomorrow and Thursday, and then a little bit warmer Sunday and Monday. Thursday and Friday, especially on Thursday, expecting bigger waves to come on through. Could see waves of 8 to 10 feet along with strong rip currents. 60s through Thursday inland with 70s Friday into the weekend, while the mountain areas have a big jump in temperatures headed your way. 40s today to the 50s tomorrow, mid to upper 50s by the weekend, and 70s return Thursday in the deserts.